Good question from Braces. We will try this out. A fairly straightforward question. Guru and Chela walk around a circular path of 115 kilometers in circumference. So we know there is a circular path. The overall distance that has to be traveled is 115 kilometers. They start together from the same point. If they walk at the speed of 4 and 5 kilometers per hour respectively, also they walk in the same direction when will they meet. So let's assume this is a starting point. One starts at 4 kilometers per hour, the other starts at 5 kilometers per hour. Right? They both start at the same point at the same time in the same direction. Right? When will they meet again is the point, not where will they meet. Right? So very simple, it is relative speed, relative distance. Right? The relative speed is 5 minus 4, 1 kilometers per hour. What do you mean by that? After the end of first kilometer, person A would have traveled 4 kilometers. Sorry, after the end of first hour, person A would have traveled 4 kilometers, person B would have traveled 5 kilometers or the gap between them is 1 kilometer. Right? At the end of second hour, person A would have totally traveled 8 kilometers, person B would have totally traveled 10 kilometers. So the difference increases by 1 and now the difference between them is 2. When they are starting and the moment they start, they are going to, one person is obviously faster than the other person. So there is going to be a gap. You need to cover that gap. The faster person has to overtake and do one additional round for them to meet. That is the only way in which people can meet when they are traveling across in the same direction, right? in a circular race. Now, so the relative speed is 1 kilometers per hour. One additional round is the idea behind meeting. So 115 kilometers they need to cover, they need to do it in 115 hours. The very straightforward question, if you understand the idea of two people are starting from the same point in the circular race, in the same direction, when will they both meet if their speeds are different? They will meet when the faster person takes one additional round than the slower person. So the faster person needs to clock one additional round which is 115 kilometers. Every hour the person gains one uh, kilometer every hour which means for 115 kilometers he needs 115 hours to gain that. That is your answer.